In the bustling world of semiconductors, the evolution has been remarkable. Once, elemental materials like silicon and germanium ruled the realm. Then, compound materials such as gallium arsenide and indium phosphide took the center stage. And now, as we hurtle into the future, we have the intriguing ultra-wide band-gap semiconductor known as gallium oxide. Now, what's so special about gallium oxide? It's been touted as the fourth generation of this unique category of materials. Its ability to withstand a robust electric field, maintain stable physical and chemical properties, and its efficient power consumption make it stand out. When we talk about the band gap, essentially the energy required to displace electrons within semiconductor materials, a bigger number indicates a better resistance to high voltage. That means a stronger ability to handle voltage and gallium oxide leads the pack. Though gallium oxide presents these advantages, it's not without its challenges. Its processing has been a notorious hurdle for scientists globally. In the international arena, the U.S. Commerce Department even imposed an export ban on this high-performing semiconductor, invoking national security issues. This move underscored the material's potential, especially in sectors as critical as defense and key infrastructure. Alan Estevez, a key figure in Commerce, pointed out the potential of gallium oxide in military applications, further hinting at the gravity of its capabilities. In the spirit of competition and perhaps retaliation, China imposed its own export controls on crucial metals including gallium. But barriers often breed innovation. At Zhejiang University, Professor Yang Duren and his dedicated team showcased an innovative approach to address the challenges posed by the international standoff. Pushing past their earlier achievements, the team unveiled four-inch wafers in August, signifying an improved, simplified, and cost-effective process. Professor Zhang Hui, part of the formidable team, revealed the mission, breaking technological bottlenecks to address the nation's semiconductor demands. He pointed out a distinct feature. Gallium oxide is unique in forming single crystals by solidifying from a melt at normal atmospheric pressure slashing fabrication expenses, and making large-scale production feasible. In other parts of the world, the creation of gallium oxide often demands a hefty price. Methods used require a significant quantity of iridium, a metal even pricier than gold. This not only amplifies the production costs, but also treads into the murky waters of international intellectual property disputes. However, the new method proposed by Yang's team at Zhejiang University paints a brighter picture, reducing iridium usage by an astounding 80%. This isn't just about cost-cutting. Their process, in its streamlined simplicity, is a boon for automation and lays the foundation for the future of industrial production. Building on this success, Zhang laid the cornerstone of the Garin Semiconductor Company in Hangzhou. Their vision is clear, to harness and refine gallium oxide materials. With their eyes set on innovation, the team has filed for multiple patents and continues to tweak their casting method for even more efficient production. Across the waters in Beijing, MIG Semiconductor Company joins the race. They too have successfully produced the coveted 4-inch gallium oxide wafers and are in full swing to construct China's inaugural complete production line. This will be a monumental feat, merging crystal growth, processing, and performance testing under a single roof. Beyond the lab, gallium oxide semiconductors are poised to transform our daily lives. Their high voltage resistance, compact size, and energy efficient nature make them indispensable in contemporary applications. From cutting edge communications and radar systems, to high-speed trains and electric vehicles. As we look ahead, gallium oxide is on track to overshadow its predecessor, gallium nitride, in the market. By 2030, it's estimated that the gallium oxide market will be worth a staggering $1.542 billion. The future is bright, and gallium oxide is shining at its heart.